Alright guys. So we're gonna try out Slick Rock. With the CR18P Evo Pro. Let's see if we can get any action. Tires really aren't that great. It's still very top heavy. It steers way better. I subtracted three inches of steering, uh, I guess, distance from the turn circle, which is good. Doesn't really have the torque twist. We're gonna have to get some good tires for it though. And this is pretty much a sheer wall. But the goal is to make it up it. This is a brushed one, so it's kind of jumpy. Okay. Now we'll go ahead and run it over. To the next sail down the line. Take these pine nails out the back. Don't need those. We're just gonna run up this guy here. Oh, I lost a clip. So it does want to run right up here, which is great. Nails. Oh. Let's save. Let's see if it'll go down. Okay. Doing good. It's a fill this little hole here. Let's see if that helps. It's pretty steep right here. Not seeing it getting much further past this, especially with pine needles, which are like logs going across the road. Oh, you're kidding me. Oh, oh dang, look at that. Something, come on. Come on, baby. Just going for it. Got so many pine needles just wrapped up in this thing right now. Oh yes, dude, that was pretty freaking. That was way buff. Look at all those pine needles. That's ridiculous. Let's get those pine needles out the back. That's. No, I get it now, I don't like it. Okay, this is good. 
I'm showing results. I did stay up all night last night. And, uh, <laughs> pretty ridiculous. But, sometimes you do what you gotta do, get what you gotta get done, done, right? Met a guy today at the RC comp. He's from uh, he has his own YouTube channel. It's Dan the Homeless Guy, and uh, he has been hanging out with the OGRC guys, coming out and crawling his mini uh, at the comp today. So he, um, he he says I'm known as the guy with the blue truck that went down the cliff. I think that's pretty funny. I guess if you're going to be known for something, you might as well be known for something cool. Alright, we're going to walk over there. head down this and maybe we can see what I'll do. Let's scale this wall. Hopefully that'll keep it from rolling. Even though I add weight in the back it's still a little bit front heavy. She's doing really good. Okay, let's try this descent right here. Hey, baby dogs. Almost. This tire is not the greatest. Okay, let's skip that one. The erosion's really helping this place really uh, be difficult for these little mini RC crawlers. It's uh, a lot of fun. 
regardless. Definitely challenges you to get better. Okay. We're gonna go over here. Steep base. Yeah, it's doing really well. Going down a pretty steep descent. Alright. Okay, that was fun, you guys. Um, going at high speed. Rip around the yard here. Look how fast that thing is. And it steers on a dime. Donuts. for watching counterproductive productions diy please like subscribe comment if uh you if that's appropriate for you um, if you want to see more content on the evo pro the um deadbolt the uh, samurai sammy the samurai um the gatekeeper build uh, judy the red cat copper the red cat um uh violet the vanquish uh the XJ build or any of the other uh, TRX4 M's. Um, we've got TRX4 uh, High Trail K10 coming. We're gonna do some, we're gonna put one nines on it, add some weight, uh, put a different body, uh, six seven drag body on it. Uh, tracks this dragster body uh, slash dragster body. And it should go with the wheelbase just fine. Um, we also have a element, um, uh, element, Utron in IFS2 uh, that we were going to unbox here shortly and we also have a Zool body we're going to put on the gatekeeper build so peace out guys and have a great rest of your day see you next time